This is Fiba Podcast. Thank you for joining us in our morning daily devotion. Stand firm and you will see your deliverance. Exodus 14 verses 13 to 14 says, But Moses told the people, Don't be afraid. Just stand still and watch the Lord rescue you today. The Egyptians you see today, you will never see again. The Lord himself will fight for you. Just stay calm. Now this verse contains God's commands to every believer, especially when you and I are confronted with difficult circumstances, maybe sometimes extraordinary circumstances. What are we to do when we cannot go forward or retreat and it seems like every escape route is blocked? I was recently in a situation I was among friends who faced a very difficult situation. There were so many suggestions, there were so many things being said, we should do this, we should do that. There was a lot of fear. And I reminded my friends, I said, "Where is our faith? Don't we serve the living God? Then why can't we just sit still and do nothing like the Bible tells us?" And my friends, we decided to do that. We said, "Lord, we commit the situation into your hands. We're not going to say what's going to happen. We're not going to fear what's going to happen. We're going to sit still and do nothing." And I'm happy to say, my friends, what we feared never came to pass. You know why? God undertook for us. Like in this verse that I just read, it says, "Don't be afraid. Just stand still and watch the Lord rescue you today." Dear listener, this word is for you today. The master's word is still the same. Stand still, stand firm. The best thing that you and I can do at these times when we're in trouble is to listen to the master's word and to take his advice. And you know what it is? Stay still. Stand firm. Despair will come and whisper, "Give up. Lie down and die." But even in the worst of times, God would have you and me to be cheerful and courageous, rejoicing in his love and faithfulness. Cowardice will say, "Retreat." But don't give in. Don't listen to those voices. Listen to the voice of God that says, "Stand firm. Stand firm." Because when we stand firm, we maintain our posture. We're ready for action. We expect further orders and cheerfully and patiently we execute those orders. My friend, I promise you, it will won't be long before you hear the voice of God say as he told Moses, "Move on. That's coming next." As you stand still, you'll soon hear the command, "Move on." In times of uncertainty, wait, my friends. If you have any doubt as to the will of God, wait. Don't force yourself into action. Father, in Jesus name, I pray for these dear brothers and sisters who listen to thy word. I pray that none of them will be under pressure to do something and maybe sometimes foolishly do something. But I pray that we would obey your voice, obey your word and hear your voice, that we would stand firm and wait for thee. In Jesus precious and holy name I pray. Amen. Dear listener, we are here to stand with you in your time of need. We want to pray with you and for your prayer request. Do you need someone to talk to? We are here for you. Call us or send a message at plus nine one six three six four two five two one six four plus nine one six three six four two five two one six four. God bless you. Thank you.